Welcome! This video will show how to add a delegated access user for a facility. Designated persons for a facility can give access to certain facility portal functions to other facility-related employees with an active portal account. Besides the designated person, for each facility, only two other facility portal users can have active access. To begin, log in through the licensing portal, navigate to the Facility Access tab. The Facility Access tab will show related employees and their access levels. Please note that users who previously had access but no longer do will also show here. To grant an employee facility access, select the Add Delegated Access User button. The Add Facility Access form will display. Enter the username or email of the person being added. The user must have an existing and active portal account to be added. Select the Enter key on the keyboard to search for the user in the system. If an account is found, the name fields will automatically be populated. Select the desired access features from the available access column. Click the arrow to move the item to the chosen access column. Once all appropriate items are added, select Save to continue. The new delegated person will now be displayed on the facility access page. Please note that the new user will only have access to view the tabs they have been granted access to in their portal. If necessary, their access can be edited at any time. To do so, select the Edit Access button. The Edit Facility Access pop-up will display. Select the appropriate items from the Chosen Access section to remove access to those features. Select the arrow to remove access. Once complete, click Save. The user access will be updated appropriately. Please refer to the Provider Handbook for additional information. This has been an overview of the process used to add a delegated access user for a facility. Thank you.